AW-129 Multirole Combat Helicopter The AW-129 Multirole Combat Helicopter is the latest variant of the A-129 Mangusta Mongoose, helicopter in service with the Italian Army. It is manufactured by Augusta Westland, a joint venture company, which was originally formed by Finn Mechanica of Italy and GKN of the UK, but is now solely owned by Finn Mechanica. The A129 International was renamed AW129 in 2007. The AW129 is a multirole helicopter for armed reconnaissance and surveillance, high-value ground target engagement, escort, fire support and air threat suppression. It is armed with powerful air-to-ground and air-to-air -air missiles, an off-axis cannon and an increased weapon payload. The five-bladed A129 International also has more powerful engines than the four-bladed Mangusta. The AW129 is able to self-deploy over 1,000 km, using external fuel tanks while carrying four air-to-air -air missiles for self-protection. The helicopter is air-transportable by C-130 and larger transport aircraft. A 129 Mangusta helicopter upgrade. The Italian Army is equipped with 60 A129 Mangusta helicopters and 15 AW129, referred to as A129 CBT, combat configuration. In January 2002, Augusta Westland was awarded a contract to upgrade the first 45 to the multirole standard. The upgrade included, 5-blade composite main rotor and 2-blade tail rotor, Rolls-Royce Gem 1004 engines, new stronger transmission with a torque of 1.700 shp, strengthened fuselage giving an increase in takeoff weight to 4,600 kg, improved weapon systems including Oto Melora 197B 20mm nose-mounted cannon and the Stinger air-to-air -air missiles, new FLIR, Forward-looking infrared system, improved countermeasure suite including EADS-AN, AAR-60 missile launch detector and new global positioning inertial navigation, GPS, INS, system. Deliveries concluded in July 2008. The five-bladed A129 International has more powerful engines than the four-bladed Mangusta. The Mangusta were successfully deployed with UN operations in Somalia, Angola, and Kosovo. Italian Army A-129 helicopters have been deployed in Iraq as part of Operation Iraqi Freedom and were deployed to Afghanistan in summer 2007, as part of the NATO International Security Force. Turkish T-129 Variant In September 2007, Turkey placed an order for 51, plus 41 options, A-129 helicopters for the Attack and Tactical Reconnaissance ATAK, program. TUSA's Aerospace Industries TAI, is the prime contractor and is responsible for final assembly of the helicopter, which will be designated T-129. Augusta Westland and A. Selson are the main subcontractors. The maiden flight of the T-129 helicopter took place on 28 September 2009 during an official ceremony held at Augusta Westland's facility in Vergiate, Italy. Deliveries are expected to begin in 2012. In November 2010, Turkey placed a $205 million order with Augusta Westland for 9 T-129 combat helicopters and spare parts. Deliveries are scheduled to be completed by mid-2012. AW-129 Helicopter Design The structure of the helicopter is a semi-monocoque design with an aluminium alloy frame. Composite materials make up almost 50% of the fuselage weight. The airframe provides ballistic protection against 12.7mm armor-piercing rounds. The engines are armor-protected. The main rotor has ballistic tolerance against 12.7mm rounds. Cockpit The pilot and gunner cockpits are in a step tandem configuration. Both cockpits are equipped with multifunction displays, which present information from the integrated management system and provide a synthetic waypoint map, navigation data, weapon status, weapon selection, communications and aircraft flight data. The displays are equipped with multifunction keyboards. The helicopter is equipped with an automatic flight control system, which provides nap of the earth flight capability and the level of stability for precise weapon aiming. A tactical navigation display enhances mission management and situational awareness. Weapons on the AW-129 The A-129 International Helicopter can be armed with Raytheon Stinger or MBDA, formerly Maitre BAE Dynamics, Mistral air-to-air -air missiles. 
Stinger missile certification was successfully completed on the Italian Army A129 CBT in October 2003, using Stinger RMP Block I missiles. The Italian Army has 15 AW129 helicopters. The helicopter has dual air-to-ground missile capability with the Lockheed Martin Hellfire or Raytheon TOW-2 missile or a mix of both, giving the gunner selective fire against low and high-value targets, and the capability of precise hits in urban environments. The Mangusta is fitted with the Heli TOW system for the TOW-2A missile. The AW-129 also has dual rocket system capability, deploying 70mm rockets for ammunition commonality with NATO countries and 81mm rockets for longer-range engagements. The Mangusta can carry four 81mm rocket launchers. A 20mm three-barrel Gatling-type turreted cannon with 500 rounds of ammunition is mounted under the nose. Countermeasures the AW-129's Electronic Warfare Suite includes an Electronica ELT-156 radar warning receiver and a BAE Systems Italia RALM-101 laser warner. The helicopter countermeasures systems include Electronica ELT-554 radar and BAE Systems IEWSAN ALQ-144A infrared jammer and chaff and flare decoy dispensers. Observation and Targeting the helicopter's infrared night vision system, HIRNS, includes a mini forward-looking infrared, FLIR, supplied by Honeywell, mounted on a steerable platform at the nose of the helicopter. The pilot's integrated helmet and display sighting system, EHADS, by Honeywell, positions a monocle over one eye and displays the view presented by the FLIR. The system provides automatic weapon aiming, which can be used by day or night. A mass-mounted sight can be installed, giving the helicopter the capability to aim and fire weapons from cover. The sight is used for target acquisition, missile tracking, laser target designation, laser tracking and laser range finding.